Dear David, Your Majesty, Camilla, Wills and Harry, uh, it's that time of year, the time of year when important folks such as you will be thinking about the New Year's Honours list. And now this is not normally something I trouble myself with, but this year, it's different. This year, I have a suggestion, a nomination, if you will. Your Chinese calendar may tell you next year is the year of the dog, but mine tells me it's actually the year of the whitehead. It's now time to polish up the silverware, dust off your tiara, and get ready to knight a man who makes Forrest Gump seem lazy. It's time to take away his mister and wipe a tear away as you say, Arise, Sir Richard Whitehead of the East Midlands. Now we know you gave him an MBE, and for this he will join us in being very grateful, but on Richard's behalf, myself and my colleagues here at Capital FM, we don't believe that's enough. You were impressed with his Paralympic gold medal for sprinting 200 metres, but that was just the start. For some reason, unbeknown to me or anyone else in their right mind, Richard decided that this summer he would run the length and breadth of this great country of ours in 40 days. That's 40 marathons in 40 days, 977 miles. I myself have never run a marathon. I can barely run 5K, yet Richard Whitehead, double amputee, has done 40 of them. And he doesn't do this for himself. For Richard, it's all about raising money and awareness for his two chosen charities, Sarcoma UK and Scope. He feels passionate about these causes, as they're really close to his heart. He has so far raised over £108,000 through his internet page alone. And the figure is rising every hour. Rich is our hero. He makes us proud to be British and he shows us that anything is possible. So it's our plea to you, knight him. Knight him good and proper, like you've never knighted anybody before.